Welcome back to the 20, 2016 Precast Show here in uh, Cleveland, Ohio. Today I'm going to take you through the components of a smart concrete sensor. So right here, if you come in close with me, we have our Geotech Smart Rock 2. At the front here, this is the first part. This is called the logger or the rock, um, in which lies the battery and the Bluetooth, uh, Bluetooth chip. Uh, the Bluetooth can extend up to 300 feet when fully exposed and the battery can run about four months. Now once we get down here to the second component, this is the temperature sensor. As you can see, we have a 16 inch cable right here, but they can also run down to about 10 feet and are fully, fully doubly reinforced. Uh, the third part of the concrete sensor is called, are called the activation rods. This is, when tied together, the sensor is turned on and begins transmitting uh, as well as logging. Uh, these, sensors, these sensors also can help reinforce the sensor to the rebar. Now, the final component of the smart concrete sensor is the wireless application, in which you can have on Android or iOS. In here we have sensor, sensor 2, it's been tagged. Um, you can have your temperature readings, right now it's about 70 degrees Fahrenheit, as, and you can set your pour time as well as your mix design. You can set pour time today, 2 o'clock, good to go. Um, you can also have your strength calculated as well as your maturity. When we slide, you can see the temperature graph over time. Um, ever since it's begun logging, you can see all of that data as well as your maturity crafted throughout that time as well as your strength. And they're plotted over time, reducing the amount of post work you need um, while on site. These are the components of a smart concrete sensor.